Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about SCF and LCM of programming. So suppose if I enter two number of oh, first number 15 and the second number 10. So if I am going to calculate the SCF, so let's do 15, 10. So at here if I am going to divide by 2, 2, 15. So add here the remainder return. So if I'm going to divide by three, so it's divide by five times, but add here it's the remainder return. If I'm going to divide by four, so here also remainder return some value. So if I'm going to divide by five, so add here this divide by three times and this divide by two times. So here after if I am going to divide, so 3 won't be divided. So at here, now let's uh, do multiplication. So at here, uh, 5 into 3 or 15, 15 into 2, 30. So the value 5, 3, 2, 5, 3 into 2. So this is uh, LCM, lowest common multiple. And about SCM, so highest common factor. So 15 or 10 so right here or this is or 3 into 5 and or this is 2 into 5 so common highest common factor so 5 is in 15 also this is also in or 10 so this is the highest 5 is the highest number between 15 and 10 so highest common factor is 5 Next, I'm going to discuss about the dry method of this program. So, if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here, after that, coincide. So, at here, I have taken uh, seven integer variables. First is n1, second, n2, next to uh, tam, scf, and lcm. and A and B. So at your out. so whatever you double code that display into the output screen and whatever I'm going to enter, so that will see by N1 and N2. So I'm going to enter N1 value 15 and N2 value 10. So N1 value go to A. So A become 15 and N2 value go to B. So B become 10. Here after, while B not equal to 0. So B value is 10, 10 not equal to 0, condition is true, so that coincides. So B value go to tam. So B is value is 10, 10 go to tam. Now here after B go to A mod B. So A value, A is 15 mod 10. So at your remainder come 5, the value. So the value come 5. So B value is now 5. Here after time value go to A. So time value is 10. Oh sorry. B equal to A mod 10. So 15 mod 10, the B become 5. So B become 5, not A. So here after time value go to A, so 10 that go to A. Here after look continue on. So check the condition, B not equal to 0, so 5 not equal to 0, condition is true. So B value go to tam. And now B equal to A mod 10. So 5, A value is 10 mod b value 5 so 10 mod 5 so it divide by 2 times remainder come 0 so it will b become 0 and now time value go to a so 5 go to a so a become 5 
here after that go up check the condition 0 not equal to 0 condition is not true so that not go inside here after a equal to s here so a value is now 5 that go to s here and sm equal to n1 into n2 so 15 into 10 divided by s here so s a value is 5 so it divided by 2 times and 15 into 2 13 so at your lcm come 30 so at your control comes to this point highest common multiple so that display into the output screen sa value so sa value is 5 so at your output come highest common factor equal to 5 and hereafter control comes to this point. So at your lowest common multiple, so that display the LCM value 30. So the output come lowest common multiple equal to 30. And hereafter that out from main function. So if you enter 15 and 10, then LCM come 5 and LCM come 30. So this is the dry end method of this program. So I hope you guys understand. So thanks for watching. See you in next week.